New at 730, a local veteran is about to receive the send off that he deserves thanks to a funeral director in Fayette County who heard his story and took it upon himself to make sure that his sacrifice does not go forgotten. Late last month, Robin Wayne Fisher was killed while attempting to cross Route 51 in Jefferson Hills. The 61 year old from Pittsburgh was homeless at the time and had limited contact with family. You looked at this individual and I wondered to myself, geez, what did this guy do for Thanksgiving? You know, where was his family? What would he do here? He's walking along Route 51. A few days later, John Fabry, the funeral director at Goldsboro Fabry Funeral Home in Fayette County, got a phone call from a distant family member who'd heard about Fisher's passing. I received a call from a, a relative of his, a, a niece, who was looking for some way to handle the burial of her uncle. Fabry did some digging and learned Fisher was widowed and a U.S. Army veteran who was the perfect candidate for a program dedicated to providing homeless veterans with a dignified burial. That if you are a qualified veteran with a uh, DD-214 and a, a honor, honorable discharge and no felonies, you can be buried in a national cemetery uh, at no charge and the government will embrace the funeral director for the casket only. Like many similar cases he's dealt with in the past, Fabry tells KDKA this one did start out sad, but being able to send this hero home with respect and honor has admittedly been a rewarding experience. And for those of you who would also like to give back to our veterans, Fabry suggests donating to your local VFW, American Legion, or other veterans organizations.